Hello, I'm Dr. Jose Rojo. It's been now 72 hours since uh, Dr. Tyson Cobb and myself, we operated together on the same patient, which was uh, me, myself. This is what the wound looks 72 hours after the operation. And we can see there's basically, basically no, no signs of hematoma. The wound is like is around one millimeter, and there's no pain when I touch or when I press. There's a very mild pain here when I press deeply there, but I mean I have to be pressing deeply, huh? Um, this is a curve I would say that's been going on with pain at at rest on the on the first uh, three days. For the first uh, 36 hours, perhaps a bit longer, almost two days. I was I was having intermittent pain that would be in between 0.5 and and one out of out of 10 on a scale of uh, of 10, and that uh, it was as I say intermittent. Sometimes I was feeling zero. Sometimes I was feeling up to one. Uh, it's disappeared somewhere here, and now I'm I'm painless at rest. Uh, I can of course do all of my basic functions. I mean, if I needed to to type and say uh, hello everybody, uh, just. Hello, uh, everybody, and so on. I mean, there's no moment in which I feel any any pain whatsoever. I can, of course, write, and say, don't know, hello, everybody. No problem, no pain on this. So there's no there's no there's no pain or no lack of function for for any any type of uh, of uh, action that involves a desk or a computer. Now, what else can I do? Um, for, for example, if you come this way, typical actions that you do in a kitchen, I can do with no, with no problem, of course, using elements like a toaster like this, or if I needed to use a two, a two, uh, two liter of Coke a bottle for pouring some water, there wouldn't be any problem. Of course, if I needed to put the liner on or and off, there's no pain for for taping it tight or opening it. Uh, for using a knife and a fork, there's no pain. So, no problem with that, with this beef. Or using a kettle, and you can see that the kettle is full. I mean, there's no pain. Um, this is a heavily loaded um, pot, in which you can see there's a lot of water and it's one of these heavy um, pots that you can find in the kitchen and when I try to grab it with one hand I, I feel some pain how much pain probably 1.5 not more uh, and uh, let's see other things I can I can show you that that I feel I can do perfectly I can perfectly use a broom no there's no pain at all for this kind of actions or if there was something I need to pick up from the floor with this other element that we use at a house, no problem. And now let's have a look at this. This is a, a suitcase. If I needed to go to work with a suitcase where I needed to travel, this weighs. Let me see if I can activate it. It's going to be the toughest thing on the there you are. So this weight, uh, 9.1, 9.0 kilos. So if I lift it up and I need to go somewhere with it, there wouldn't be any problems with it. I have no pain. And now uh, there's some pain, but minor, when I do this kind of thing. If I came this way and I did some push-ups, and I started doing one, two, three, four, or five. I can feel some pain. There's still like two out of ten, probably, uh, pain-wise. But there's there's something else quite nice to see that you can do this with this kind of operation. And of course, you cannot do any of this with a standard operation. I don't see a way to do it without being un, un, uh, safe, you know. But if you wanted to take the bar like this and do pull pull ups, I I feel that. There's basically no pain for doing all these pull-ups I'm doing. 
So it's probably 0 0.5, but I, I feel that fortunately uh, the operation is, is standing all this uh, stress test and that I'm basically very happy as a patient. So I sincerely feel that the, the operation, the way we designed it and the way uh, we implemented it, makes a, it, it makes a very a large difference with uh, previous operations. Especially when in my case, I don't know if you can see it here, I had a previous accident and I had my carpal tunnel release. It was a large uh, release and it was due to a, another injury, it wasn't because of a carpal tunnel itself. But I, I really felt um, that this was painful. It's not the same as, as this time with this thing. So that's basically it. Thank you very much. We may meet in another occasion. Goodbye.